Hi friends, Teacher Rachel here today and we are going to do a project. Each one of you got a piece of paper um, with circles and letters in it and then you should have also gotten some blank circles. Um, so today you're going to need those circles, you'll need scissors, glue, and then some sort of um, other piece of paper um, if you want. So if you look at the letters I have, I have the letters R A C H E L. So that's R A C H E L. Does anybody know what that is? That is my name. Yeah, that's my name. It says Rachel. So you should have one that has your letters on it. Do you remember how to say your letters with your hands? We can go through the alphabet real quick if you want. Watch for your letters. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Now we've sung the A, B, C's. Next time won't you sing with me? All right, did you find your letter in there? Keep practicing. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna cut out our circles. They don't have to be perfect, um, but just go ahead and cut them out. Um, so what letters did you get? I think there's a lot of A's. I know we have a lot of A's and lots of S's. And we have a whole class that has J's in it. All right. Let's see here. There's my E. I'm kind of going backwards on how my name is spelled. Ooh, <laughs> I cut a little piece out of that one. That's okay. Now I'm gonna glue mine down. You don't have to. You can always keep them um, in a baggie or just keep them separate. Um, and that way you can rearrange them and practice your name. You can also see what other words you can write with your name. Um, there's a few things. I can't do a lot with my name, but I'll show you what I can, different things I can do with my name. All right, and then you're gonna need at least one blank one. So here's my letters. I'm gonna cut out one more blank one. Okay. All right, so there's my circles that I have. So what you can do is, I'm grabbing some markers here. You can take your piece of paper Here's my paper. And if I wanted to spell my name, I could do R A C H E L. There's Rachel. And then I'm going to, let's see, draw a little face. this, give me a little nose, I don't want to all orange, but it'll be close enough. Give me a little nose, so there I have a snowman. So now I've got a snowman that has my name. Can you see that? You can also take it, and remember when we did the caterpillars? You can do a caterpillar. Um, you don't have to glue it down or anything like that, but let's see what else I can spell. I can do C A. R, that spells car, C-A-R, and if I put an E on there, that says care. I'm like, I care about you guys. Um, we can do H, let's see, A-R-E, that spells hair, not hair on your head, hair like a bunny rabbit. Yep, and we can do, what else can I spell with my name? I can spell char. Char is like when you when you burn something, you char it. C H A R. Char. Hmm. I can do 
What else can I do? Hmm, I can do... There's all sorts of stuff you can do. So let's try rearranging your letters and see what you can figure out you can spell with your letters. There's lots of different words and lots of different combinations. I mean, you can make it with a snowman or you can just save it. Um, you can use a glue stick and glue it down. You can make kind of um, a wobbly snowman. I can do like R, A, C, H, E, L, and then give him a head. Kind of wobbly snowman. Or you can turn it sideways and do it like a caterpillar. Whatever you want, just have fun with it. You can color these. Um, yeah, just use your imagination and take pictures and show me what you've done. All right, see you next time.